hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to convert a diagram from Droyo to microsoft excel let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in microsoft excel i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go converting a diagram from droyo to microsoft excel is not a direct feature okay but what we can do is to achieve a similar results using some of the following methods now number one option that i could suggest for example you have been working with a specific diagram that you wanted to uh, export or convert to uh, your excel as, um report or presentation i want you to go to the file section all right and what we can do is export it as a, as an image shut that's one way all right so you can choose from any of the following images such as png jpeg or svg for example we're going to be choosing png which is one of the best in terms of um importing or exporting we can choose from any of the following you can put in a border width if you want it you can put in selection only diagram or the whole page all right now you can put in a shadow or a grid and the appearance as well so you have all these options if you click on the export button you would be asked if you where do you want to save the exported png file that you wanted to convert to a uh, an excel um file now you can go for a google drive your storage option or to your onedrive github gitlab or of course i'm gonna be choosing the download option to my computer now the next thing is i want you to open your microsoft account specifically the microsoft 365 i want you to open the excel from here we can start from a template if you want you want to check with the template for example i'm going to be choosing something like uh, a project tracker because for one if you want to click the preview button so this doesn't look good maybe uh, a personal monthly budget for that maybe um or maybe just click the create new blank to start from scratch from here you can rename this as something like this one right here and we can insert the picture that we have saved from our device takes a little while but you have already inserted the file and of course from here the diagram has been converted to jpeg but of course you have inserted it to excel and you can use and create more reports along the way so that's one way now the second option that i'm going to do is go back again to the Troyo. Now this time I want you to click the file section. Again, now this time I'm going to use the export as PDF. Why? Because what we can do is click the export button. I'm going to export it to my computer again. And then once it's downloaded, I'm gonna switch quickly to a platform called Adobe Acrobat. Okay, so basically Adobe Acrobat is an online platform wherein you can easily convert any pdf to microsoft excel spreadsheet if you go to our gplabs youtube channel you would notice that we have a lot of adobe acrobat tutorials for you to check out there's a lot and if you haven't already you might want to click on the subscribe button so you'll get notifications in our latest content now from here all we have to do is select a file or drag and drop the pdf file to convert it into a microsoft excel spreadsheet so let's do that now once the file has been added all i gotta do is click the section right here that says convert to xlsx which is going to be the microsoft excel file format i want you to click on it all right conversal we'll convert in a short while just wait for it now your file is ready all right so from here all I have to do is click continue if you want that. Get into your browser Microsoft Office. It will be forwarded here. But since I have already integrated my Microsoft Excel to these platforms in the past, you would notice that my diagram has been converted easily to Microsoft Excel, which is kind of a very handy tool.
because Microsoft Excel is excellent for organizing and analyzing data. Embedding a diagram alongside a data table enhances ethic context and visual representation, right? For example, in workflows or process diagrams and combining visual representations with performance, Excel provides a holistic view of all of these. It is a standard tool in most organizations make it easier to share diagrams with team members who might not use Troyo, right? So embedding diagrams in Excel allows colleagues to view the visuals within the same file as the data, improving communication and collaboration. Now, since this file has been converted from Droyo and then to Adobe Acrobat and to Microsoft Excel, and if you want to insert another photo from uh, Droyo using the uh, diagram, you might want to click on a new tab here. Right? If you want to add a new tab, you can also do that. But the thing is, it's kind of like view-only section. So you need to get the uh, section here. Click the editing changes. So that one of your team members, for example, is going to be working with alongside with you, or if you're working with um, multiple freelancers, maybe you're a client, they will be able to put a comment, the feedback to the workarounds or the file that you guys have been working with, right? So when using Excel's, and then uh, converting it here from diagram, you can now have a live data sources, ensuring that visuals stay updated with current metrics or statuses. So in the file section, you can, of course, print this, click the share button, copy a link to this workbook. If you click that, you should be able to send it to your multiple clients via email, or you can basically export this again to different file formats now. The magic idea is you can download this a PDF if you want a copy of this document to your computer and download this as a sheet, as a CSV, and send it to your client, all right? Because once you have imported the diagram here in Droyo, you can create more formulas along the way. Create a formula, add more data, because Excel files are easy to print or share, making it very convenient to include diagrams and reports or handouts, all right? You can put in uh, filter, validation, split checks, columns, custom sort, and sort descending. So you have all these. Now, the diagram is just an added representation of workflows, which can be paired with the Excel's analytical tools, such as formulas again and conditional formatting. So we have been using uh, Droyo and Excel for quite some time because the process and flows in diagrams can be directly related to Microsoft Excel charts or graph enhancing analytical insights. All right, so you have all these. Now, Excel will allow you to further export report in PDF or any other accessible formats preserving diagrams for broader use. I believe that's it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.